now we will go through third part of this uh, entire computation how to compute the mutual information by using KL divergence so what is mutual information actually mutual information measures the relationship between two simultaneously sampled random variables another important point is the information communicated in one random variable generally gives some insight about another for example how it is possible suppose X represents the event of rolling a six-faced die. Six-faced die. Now, Y represents the event where outcome is equal to zero if event faces comes, and outcome is equal if odd face comes. So, in these two cases, it is clear that y gives some indication about in event x another example is like x may be equal to tossing a coin and y may be another event like outcome equal to 0 if head comes and out is equal to 1 if tail comes so here the value of y gives some indication about the insight of about uh, some insight about event x or tossing a coin now we can formalize the computation of mutual information the mutual information suppose we have a probability distribution a with events ai where ai represents the ith event having event size m now suppose we have a probability distribution a where ai represents the ith event and number of events are m so value of i varies from i to m similarly bj represents the jth event of b where number of events are n so value of j varies from 1 to n then mutual information between a and b can be can calculated as summation from i is equal to 1 to m summation from j is equal to 1 to n probability of joint probability distribution of discrete random variables a and b this is also joint probability distribution of discrete random variables a and b this is probability of occurrences of event ai in probability distribution a probability of occurrences of event bj in probability distribution b uh, we can compute this uh, mutual information formula with the help of KL divergence like mutual information A and B is equal to KL divergence from joint probability distribution of A and B to probability distribution of A into probability distribution of B and this is uh, if we explain this part and this part then we again get the same formula that is obtained here now how to use this in actual computation how to use or how to compute the mutual information suppose we have two sets A and B A represents three words Kullback, Leibler and Divergence B represents two words KL and Divergence now we represents the term of A is equal to A1, A2 and A3 and term of B like B1 and B2 then in that case 
the mutual information between A and B can be computed by using joint probability distribution joint probability distribution of A1 and B1 into log E joint probability distribution of A1 and B1 divided by probability of occurrences of event A1 into probability of occurrences of event B1 plus P joint probability distribution of A1 and B2 so the only part uh, which are changing is this combinations so first we compute the joint probability distribution with this at the second time we computed the joint probability distribution with B2 and similarly next time we take another variable A2 we compute the joint probability distributions with B1 and then with B2 here the, this part is same as used here only the probability will change based on the combinations we take so this combination is A2 and B2 A2 and B1 so here it will be A2 and B1 here the next combination is A2 and B2 so A2 and B2 similarly we can compute all those things now how to compute the joint probability distribution of term A1 and B1 for that uh, we can use uh, in this case so because we have given only two sets A and B and no other information then in that case there are several ways to calculate the these probability scores and this probability scores for entire calculation the first one is to use uh, some external corpus like uh, with the help of Wikipedia so here the joint probability distributions from uh, between A and B1 A1 and B1 can be computed by count of documents which contains A1 and B1 both means here count of Wikipedia documents divided by count of total number of Wikipedia documents similarly P A1 will be equal to count of documents Wikipedia documents which contains the term A1 divided by count of total number of Wikipedia documents with the help of such kind of external or domain specific corpus we can get all these values and finally by putting all these values we can easily calculate the mutual information between two phrases like Kullback, Leibler and Divergence and KL and Divergence it is important to note that with the help of uh, similar kind of external or, or domain specific corpus we can easily compute the mutual information between very short phrases we can identify the similarity between tweets and uh, so many uh, different kind of operations that we can perform on short text by using KL divergence these are the references that uh, we I have already used in the preparation of uh, this entire tutorial and try to make all things very simple